Um, and you know, I don't know. I, I I guess from a heathen mindset, like it doesn't it doesn't bode well to maintain that idea when you know that that's anti order. That's anti what the gods represent in our belief with with the gods as the holy powers that they are there is order there is structure there is uh you know this uh i guess sense of peace right they they they, they want they don't want the constant strife the constant struggle even though there is that always that's always happening in in the nature I mean, Nidog is always gnawing at the roots. There is those agents of entropy. You know, uh, Fenrir will eventually be released uh, and break free from his from his chains and and, and you know bring the the Ragnarok on the gods and and mankind. And so it's it's, it's inevitable. It's there. Um, but there's always a balance. There's always something that that brings it back uh, to a state of peace. Um, and. I don't know, man. Like this is a tough one for me because I I I choose not to. I I can't. I just I I don't know. I can't. No matter how bad things get for me, um, I always, you know. And I'm just gonna say personally for me, you know, no matter how bad things have gotten for me over the years, I've always I was brought up in a way, um, and that and that's probably a large part of the reason why I have uh, the, the the perspective that I have is is how I was raised or how I was brought up. Like I always have. Uh, had and, and maintained no matter how bad it's gotten i've always maintained that um i need to learn what i can from this and i'm not just going to get enveloped and sucked in to this defeatist mentality or it's all bad and it's all you know uh pain it's all suffering um because as they say you know it, you know uh, not going with the notion of everything will be better but they can function in society. So why why isn't it going to be better? That's a choice. You're choosing violence. You're choosing destruction. You're choosing the chaos. Um, I you know, and again, this is this seems like a very specifically targeted thing, and I you know I don't know the specifics of it. But when I hear stuff like this, it just makes me think that well, whatever the situation is, if you want it to be different, if you want it to change, then change it. Okay, if, if if you don't want to be fat anymore, then stop eating so much food. Get up off your ass and exercise. Drink more water. Be more active. Do all the things that is going to change the situation of what it is, right? Um, that 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 is understanding that things are the way they are because of the choices that we've made. And sure, there are certainly times or circumstances. Uh, that are contributors uh, to the thing where we are, you know, a victim, uh, I guess you could say, or, you know, the, a victim of the circumstance. But I think I think the majority of, of times, and I, and I mean that sincerely, I think the majority of times um, the victim uh, is, is, is not truly a victim of anything other than their own decisions, their own deeds, their own actions. Yes, absolutely. There are times and there are uh, situations wherein an innocent victim is is harmed and, and bad things happen to decent and good folk. I'm not delusional and I'm not in denial of the fact that, you know, and, I, and I'm not victim shaming here when I say that, yes, there are definitely times and in, in situations where there, you know, true victims are uh, experiencing negative things that, that ruin their lives. I think again, though the majority of the time is there's it, it's mostly my life sucks, and it's nobody else's fault but mine. And if you're in denial about that or delusional about that, uh, then you're not gonna you're not gonna find a solution. You know, you have to face those those hard things and those difficult things to be uh, honest with yourself and realize, yeah, this is the way things are is because of me, uh, my decisions, my choices, my actions. All right, you know, so um, this is how I feel about it. I'm not a professional. I don't have professional background with psychology or anything like that. Um, that's just how I feel.